What is going on you guys? Welcome to today's video. We got the bags packed, just about to head out. I didn't show you yesterday, but look how clean the wagon's looking. This thing looks killer. Got the KWV ones on it. The whole front end's all matching now. And check this out. We got Casey's BBS's back here. And in the back back, we also have, wait for it, wait for it. Bam! BBS RC041. So Retro Wheels said they can re-drill these ones for about 20 down to 4 by 100 He has a special way he's gonna show me, but we're taking these ones, we're taking those ones, and we're off to Belgium. Now there's also one more thing I might have done to these wheels. I haven't fully decided just yet. Currently, this is a two-piece wheel. Uh the face unbolts and comes out, and the barrel and lip are one. They're currently 17 by eight or eight and a half. Can't remember actually what size it is, but I might have them made into three-piece wheels and make them 17 by nine all around. What they would do is keep barrel keep the face cut this lip off and then add a bigger lip to make them three piece and make them 17 by nine we'll see currently they're getting the redrill but we'll see about three piece haven't fully decided just yet but other than that the car is fully packed up we've got some beautiful weather today we're ready to go i love that color i think it was sick there it is the big bridge went from germany to belgium we've actually been to belgium a lot of times we've been what it's like our fourth or fifth time here yeah we've been a bunch but there's a sign right there i am welcome to belgium once again so fun fact i couldn't figure out why i kept seeing all these yellow plates that is the uh the netherland plate i'm like we're in belgium i'm seeing so many just yellow plates everywhere turns out we're actually in the netherlands right now and crossing back over into belgium so welcome to a new place Right now we're over here in the uh, the Netherlands and about to cross back. This is the border right here to Belgium. We're gonna cross over right there, looks like. So hopefully there's a sign. I saw no sign coming in, but maybe there'll be a sign uh, going back out. All right, we're just about to the border. There should be a sign or no sign. Oh, I guess right there. Oh, well, there's the border. There's the water, and we're officially back into Belgium. Our fun little, uh, I don't know, 30 minute drive to the Netherlands. We've officially made it back. This building right up here. I was in a while. When we get your wheels? We got your wheels back in what, 2019? Yeah, we're You can go left around the backside again. I think it was 2019 we got your wheels. Was it 2020? I think it was 2020. 2020. But it's still so funny. You found wheels like three and a half hours away. And we meet these guys, and they're some of the coolest people ever. Now they're good friends of ours. Got the B4 Passat wagon chilling. I see this company truck here. Good old retro wheels. Little Mark II in the corner. Let's see if uh, it was knock. Oh, there you are. Hello. How are you today, sir? I'm good. And you? Good to see you again. Oh, you're good. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll do the, the I'm, um, metal just, metal work. Yeah, I'm just done. Um, working so man i love this place i made it <laughs> <laughs> oh man if you haven't been here before retro wheels and the man himself yeah, and dirty man today all of the wheels still what you been doing we're doing the curb damage and ah. sanding down and... so lots of just metal work and yeah yeah <laughs> dirty stuff yeah. Hey, it's packed in here we came last time it was pretty much open throughout here yeah last time you could walk around and <laughs> so bu so business is good yeah i need my new shop asap that's <laughs> awesome that's good to hear if you like wheels this is literally like it's the best place like i said last time we were here this was all open and now he's like business is just oh, booming yeah. and they have so much going on these ones just got curb rash fixed so next will be chemical stripping uh some futuras over there amg wheel i mean this is just so much stuff some d90s down here and then all of these are just unsplit factory rs's dang look at all they're everywhere i right, what sets you want mm, got these down here oh they're all so beautiful yeah. i think these are 16 or 17 i want this set i like this set and it's like this boxes oh he said he bought a few but he bought a lot good lord 16 16s down there's just wheels everywhere and you bought a lot of these wheels huh are these all the ones you got back here what? yeah, those yeah ones? they're also all ronald's yeah you bought a you bought a few yeah he's like yeah i bought a couple yeah you bought a couple oh i just love seeing all these rs's that just chill here and the center locks up top those are cool oh and some coppers 
Beautiful. Is this just a cool collection? I love it. <laughs> There's wheels everywhere. Yeah, you can every open boxes if you want. Bid and every barrels and lips and we can search through stuff. Yeah, there's just so much stuff back here. It's a little light. Oh, these are LMs. Yeah. What are these? In the 18s or 19s? 20s. Oh, 20 inch LMs? Jeez. And then these ones. And ooh. I like these ones. The face mount RFs. Uh, yeah. I like I, those. I had them on my Mark II. And then I took them off and then they. <laughs> they just sit? Yeah, they just sit. Interesting. <laughs> Those are beautiful. There's just so many wheels. I see faces back there, tons of lips and barrels. That's so cool. Ooh, very nice. Oh wow. So these came from Greece. Yeah. Very cool. Original four times 117 inch BBS three piece new. Brand new too. That's so cool. Yeah, yeah this man has all of the wheels. I'm paying for a cab. I'm paying for a tab. She's digging for the lines. Shit, don't give me time. I'm paying for a cab. I'm paying for a tab. She's eager for the lies. She be digging gold in my pocket. She be calling the girlfriend. Say she got a lover who acts like a daddy. Y'all just fucked up from daddy. She be bitch in the molly. I'll be calling the girlfriend. Saying I am a god. No, it's all a flip. It's all a thing. But a girl who wants my money Oh, she got both hands in my pockets And I'm fine with that So we've seen, well, we've seen partial of the inside There's still so many more wheels But now we're going in here Which is where my three-spoke OZ Cygnus Have been chilling since, well, 2020 Still not sure if he's gonna sell them to me or not, but he might. I have to convince him a little bit, but there's so many wheels in here. It's wild. Oh! <laughs> Into. I love this spot. Look, it's just wheels. Oh, there's more than last time. Before you could walk down the center, now it's just full all the way down. Just. It's beautiful. There's just so many beautiful wheels in here. Yeah. Look at that. BBS, some more CH. All right, where are my OZs at? I know they're in here. Oh, look how little these are. All the 13s? Mm -hmm. Some RFs. The OZs were on the right side a long time ago. Do you see any three spokes to your right somewhere? Yeah. We got some big old slicks here. I mean, this is awesome. Let's say, when we came here last time, this was all open down the middle, and now you can't even walk anymore. <laughs> Mini wheels, like I'm scooching, like it's it's tight in here now. Maserati wheels, Mercedes. You want those big like? 20s? Yeah, like Lorenzers back there. Some OZ Futuras right here looks like. What are those? Look at those behind you. What are those things? I, know, I saw those. What are they? What is that? Jaguar? What does it say? It says BRS. Oh, Saab. Oh, Saab. Those are <laughs> interesting. Look at those things. That's about as nineties as it gets. All right, we gotta find my. Uh, I think they're on the other side. They might be, yeah. Unless they're all in here. They're somewhere in here. I mean, there's just there's. Oh, there's a little thing. In here. You found them? No, I. Yeah, Porsche G60 phone dials. Oh, I like these. I'm not sure the name, probably AMG style. Oh, that's great. Oh, Nathels. Look at that. Four to one hundred Nathels too. Snowflakes. I don't see. Ooh, are those OC Blitz? Oh, those are Alfa Romeo. I haven't found them yet. Uh, yeah, I'm looking. Uh, There's just a lot of wheels in here. I don't know. <laughs> Looks like RS is back here. Good question. Where are they? Uh -huh. I like these. These are nice. Yeah. Very nice. They can't be far. They were on that side, yeah. I thought, at one point, but I don't see them anymore. Unless they're one of these ones we can't see the face too well right now. <laughs> I like your, your Nathels over ah, here. The, these are the barrels. Oh, right there? <laughs> no to get one out. Oh, that them? Uh, yes. <laughs> oh, they're so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> so what are the chances you let these go? Are they 5 by 114? Um, or 
They look like they're 114. Yeah, like. I should, should measure it. I don't know it for sure. You can read it. At, uh, I can't tell. It says 17 by 8. Yeah, it doesn't say as normally. It says yeah. also maybe. At the it rest. looks like 114. They'd fit right on my Jetta. I can, <laughs> I can measure them. That's okay. Yeah. These are, I love these wheels. Like these are such beautiful wheels. They are, yeah. Oh, he's got them. Nice. Because they are, um, this is the only model of, yeah, they have this in the cap. You can't, oh, I see. I, I can't machine caps for them because it's not, it's not completely round. Yeah. A little. Not fine though. Yeah, these electronic green, then polished and polished would be the move. And then maybe something for this too. Yeah. I probably match this and then. I know they make, Little carbon rings for this as well. Yeah, I have I have polished rings and carbon rings. Mm. Polished rings. Yeah, lots of ideas here. We're making our way back out to uh <laughs> the daylight. It's funny. So after we leave here, we're going to go by his yeah. new shop is being built, and then also to his dad's house. This and all of this is like his side collection. His personal collection is at his dad's house, which is sick. But I mean, like this collection is honestly beautiful, and my OZs are in there, and hopefully he'll sell them to me at some point because those wheels paint match on the pink floor to be like the perfect combination also good time to note if you haven't already followed retro wheels follow them do it we've been seeing all these wheels almost forgot we brought two sets with us we gotta unload these ones the good old bam and then her wheels we don't have the biggest collection but we got some nice wheels of our own so these one like i said will go from the uh open this up five by 120 which is that down to four by one hundred, and also we might have him cut the lip off, make three piece. We'll see on that. Look at that! We got the BBSs in the shop, and we have my wheels in the shop. Man, I love coming to this shop. It is such a cool place. Even his work van is just so cool. There's just wheels everywhere. I say, if you haven't already, make sure you guys check them out. Also, very very cool things to come from my BBS wheel. Talked to him a bunch about those, and got some big plans for those things. What else I just got? Spare set of front Mark III Colovers. Not sure what I need them for, but you know what? Got them. Can't complain. Spot number two. Look how cool this building is. So this is Dimitri's new shop. What we just saw, we went to last time. That's his current shop, um, but this one they're currently building. It's beautiful. They have a showroom, a whole wheel like powder coating section, the workshop. There's also a VR6 Mark III. I'm not sure why that's there, but I want to see it. Wow, this is cool. This is beautiful. Yeah, not yet. But <laughs> no, as it is right now. I mean, it's going to get better, obviously, but it's cool. Yeah. So you said showroom you're going to have. Yeah, this will be the, the showroom. It gives us the full tour. I want to see everything. <laughs> and this will be the, the showroom. I also have some nice cars inside here. Yeah. And, and yeah. This is <laughs> awesome. It's a place to chill. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, this part will be the stock. Some more room here than, uh, than my own place. Yeah, it really is. Yeah, this is huge. This will be more stock or my own workshop or yeah. yeah. This is I have not decided what to do with this. Normally, that side because it it will be closed also in the middle. Yeah. Um, left side is is rented rented out to someone. Okay. It's gonna rent it out, then I will have some financial. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was good. <laughs> if I don't bend it out, I will have some room to work on my own car. Yeah. So yeah. Will, yeah. I have to ask though. What, yeah, is, what, what is this? That's my Mark Three VR6. That's your is Mulberry too, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> we pulled it in. I was like, Yeah. He's got all the wheels. He has the beautiful shop now, and you got a Mulberry VR6. Good choice. Yeah, I bought it half, half a year ago. Yeah, um, I haven't seen it at all. No. No, it only has one hundred and twenty thousand kilometers. So it's yeah. Beautiful car. I think he is at home. Ah, it's open. Oh, that color is so good. Mm. Yeah, I bought it from the second owner. Yeah, beautiful car. Factory leather too. Very yeah. nice. And it's still completely original. Nobody <laughs> screwed with it. So. Yeah, no, this car is in amazing condition. What year is this one? 97? Uh, 97. 97? Oh, 96? Yeah. Factory badge on it still. Yeah, and um, all the paperwork from day one is, is filled in, so it's... Yeah, yeah it's that's so cool. Actually, the, the pink float I have has yeah. 122,000 kilometers, but I have the book, all yeah. the original maintenance service yeah. to it. It's just, it's cool to have. Yeah, this one also, I count. I still need to keep it inside the garage for four or five years. Yeah. Because if I want to drive it now, it will cost me 6,000 euros to put it on the road. In oh my Lord. 
Yeah. Is that just for like yeah. registration and yeah, stuff yeah, or like registration and yearly taxes because this is um, yeah, a big engine and not good for the environment. So oh, you wow. have to pay a lot of a lot for these cars. Now I'm gonna offer this. You can say no. <laughs> but you can keep it at my house if you want to. <laughs> and I'll drive it for you, just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, no, I yeah. Have, um, I have dealer rates. Places. Yeah, oh, that so works. I, yeah. I put them on and drive them. I drive the car around a little bit, so it's yeah, it's, yeah. it stays fresh. No, yeah, definitely a beautiful car and one of the best colors too. Yeah. I love it. So now stop number three. We saw his current shop, his new shop in process. And now we're at the uh, the house. Well, your dad's house, correct? Yeah. I can tell it's your house because there's wheels literally everywhere still. I see a race car. There's a race car in there. Oh, there is a race car in there. Oh, it's a Lancia. Oh, you have a whole race car, not even like a, you got a whole race car in here. This is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's, yeah, that's right. Wow, that's beautiful. I was not expecting this at all. What a day we're having. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my. I have no words, but this is wow. This is beautiful, and yeah, again, there's just wheels everywhere. Yeah, these I bought <laughs> last week, and I, they still not have moved to my uh, yeah. my shop, so I still need to sort them out. And yeah, this is wild. Look at those up there, the BMW ones. Those are really oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, those are, really are those from the uh, eight series? What are those from? The older one? Yeah, I don't know for sure. Like the older eight fifty, maybe. This is wild. I don't have any words to say. Oh, there's a Corrado here too. You know, yeah. we're leaving. I want to go home, right? <laughs> yeah, wow. My daddy, my Corrado, and another Golf One I have. Nice. And this RS is on poor seats on. This is one of the coolest places I've ever been. <laughs> and you have the checkered floor. I've always worn the checkered floor. What year's the Corrado? Uh, 91. 91? 91 G60 in red. I think the best color on a Corrado, except for the purples, the reds are definitely my favorites. And I, then... Uh, I wanted the red one because I have the red rally. I have a, yeah. a red 84 GTI. I have the red G60 project and then, yeah. This one too. Man, that's beautiful. It only has 120,000 kilometers also. So, so it's, it's brand new, basically. Yeah, I bought it from first donor. If you see the engine bay, it's, yeah. The interior is clean and the engine bay is... Oh yeah, it's got the uh, tan leather. Ah, it's so clean. Yeah. <laughs> Just OEM fresh. Yes. Beautiful car. And then beautiful TVR and then the Caddy. And this. Oh. Yeah. Lots of stuff in here. I was not expecting this. I was expecting to see like a little like car collection. But yeah, this is a car collection. Yeah, yeah there are yeah, there, is... there is more. You can see the rest. Oh, there's more than this? Yeah. There's Just... more than this. <laughs> yeah. All of my dad's stuff. This is cool. Next week so he needs nice. to take up four more cars. Yeah? He bought four cars in Tenerife. Jeez. This is wild. This thing is so cool to see in person. Mm -hmm. What's the story behind this? How long have you like, this is your dad's one? Yeah, he bought it four or five years ago, also in Tenerife. Yeah. Um, it's not original or normally it's not original. Okay. It has the engine of the Lancia Delta. Okay. Uh, but it has original papers. That's, and that's... There, there is a myth that says that in the 90s, there were built four or five Stratuses with original engine from the, from the Delta the Delta and on original chassis because if you look at the chassis is not a replica chassis it looks yeah, like it's it factory looks, yeah it looks like original but the papers are original but in theory it can't be original because it's yeah, yeah. it's built in the 90s yeah. that's wild and it's four lug too it's kind of cool to see yeah it should be five five lug the original yeah. ones are five but and this is four this is made on the axles of the of the, yeah of the, Type of the Integralis. So. Gotcha. We actually saw a red Lancia Delta on the way here, up the road a little bit. Okay, nice. Very cool. This thing is wild. These back wheels are so wide. Yeah, huge. Yeah. 
these are huge. This is cool. All right, let's see some more. I mean, I I don't have to get better than this, but we'll see some more. So now we're at the next next garage. Another Porsche. And then the NSX is somewhere, I believe. I think the dog's coming out in a minute. Let's take a quick peek in here. Another old school Porsche. This is so cool. Like the sea, like, hold on, watch for a second. Why does he have so many garages? I just want That's to what I'm saying, all the garages. Oh, look at this poppy come in. Are we friends? Oh, he's so cute. Come here. Yeah, Are we just friends? Show, show me on his leg, so it's... Aww. Are we good? Hi. He's Sean. Hello, good to see you again. Yeah. You good? I can get a pet. Oh, he's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Yeah, you so will be gone. The tail's wagging though. We're okay. The tail's wagging. We're good. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there we go. Now you can take him. Yeah, right. <laughs> right. He can fit in the wagon. Yeah. Oh, you're so sweet. Oh, she's coming out. More. I'm pushing Alantia. This is a good day. What a day we're having. This is that such is so a cool, cool car. Those back wheels are <laughs> massive. Yeah. It's like they just took two tires and just kind of glued them together. So you just like do like a wheelie right away. Yeah, they are also crazy expensive. Oh, I bet. What do you think? You like the car? Look, you didn't see he opened his. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the next this one. one he's working on now. Um, wow. he, it's um, built on the frame of a Porsche. Yeah. It's uh, a gold up all. Okay. And it was made in Belgium. It's uh, oh, who was in Local. That's cool. Only built um, 100 pieces of it. So. Wow. Yeah. Wow. You, one. you need to love it. You you love it or you hate it. <laughs> and you said this is the original retro wheel shop right here. Yeah. This is where it all started. Yeah. And now you have that awesome shop being built right now. That's so cool. Yeah. That's awesome. I'm, I, congrats on your success. That's, that's <laughs> awesome. And again, if you're not following Retro Wheels, check him out because yeah. he's a super nice man. You're this is like awesome. Like this little one too, this huge. I know. To see the OG shop and the suit you have now is yeah, so cool. All I love stuff and there's just so much stuff. <laughs> yeah, this is a little bit of garbage place. But... No, this is amazing. I just like stuff everywhere is so cool. And that's your Mark One? Yeah, Mark Two. Yeah. Oh, Mark Two GTI. It. Um, I went to the MOT with it. It got a green card, so it was okay. I drove yeah. it home, and then the, um, the alternator snapped off. Oh wow! <laughs> so jeez. Yeah. And now it's sitting here for one month or two months. I need to fix it again. And then... Yeah. You saw the girls up top, babe. Up here, above your head. All the oh, that's so GTI cool. girls. Oh, that's cool. From Worthersy. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> Look at all the OG caps he's got in here. Oh, you have a whole entire case of caps. Yeah, this is the personal collection part. Jeez. That's awesome. Oh, look at those little stands. Those yeah, those are cool. cool. That's cool. Oh, yeah, it's the retro wheels too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Some old, like, uh, merchandise stuff. Yeah. That's super cool. Yeah, I appreciate you taking us around. This has been yeah. the coolest day we've had so far. Yeah. And we're eating french fries, which I'm excited about yeah. too. This yeah, there is are so some cool. more wheels inside if you. Oh, uh, there's more wheels? I don't doubt that there's more wheels. Yeah. It's possible to get inside. Yeah. I got a, I got a light. I don't know if you can see it. That's. <laughs> there is my transport collection. Oh, yeah, back there. Yeah. And so up here, and I see Mark three headlights and some. All the hubs. Yeah, all the hubs. Yeah. All parts laying around and yeah. not doing anything with it. Still so this cool, is though. so cool. Yeah, and here are more wheels. Jeez. Yeah, wheels on wheels on wheels for your other wheels and some more wheels. That's cool. Are those all split? Uh, the Pinafrina? Yeah. Nice. These are the. Oh. Oh. Clean up all this mess. Oh, I got you the light. I got you. Oh, but there it goes. Are those louvers? Yeah. Oh, interesting. <laughs> These are uh, center locks. These are new old stock. Dang. 
Beautiful wheels. I was also thinking those uh, for the GTI as well. Yeah, those five log. Cool. Oh yeah. These are the ah, these are the same, but it's also new old stock, but 16 inch. Oh, 16s as well. Yeah. Man. These I'm those keep. Nice. These were from my personal collection, but yeah. I'll, in my new shop, I'll put all of this on the wall. On the wall. Yeah. yeah. That's gonna be the coolest like art display ever. Yeah. I think. It's... No, this has been incredible. Oh, we got more boxes. Let's open them. Inside here are yeah, one of the rarest DBS RSs. Are those 18s? Yeah, but original 18s. 18 inch wow. OG RSs. What's the bolt pattern on these ones? Uh, BMW. Oh, 50120? Yeah. OG, no step lip, no step barrel, OG 18s. Yeah, these are huge, but OG 18s. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Still would have a car for them, but yeah, one day. Yeah, one day. Dang. Yeah, <laughs> That's so that cool. So many are also on a 14 inch BBS RS. Yeah, all these caps in here. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these also will get a, a nice place in my new shop. Yeah. This is, I think this collection did not grow the past years because the prices of these things are getting oh i know ridiculous. Abs absurd yeah so. but that's probably more than i've ever seen in one spot ever <laughs> yeah. you have the whole collection yeah this is all from yeah six seven eight years ago when i yeah. then i was really into collecting things uh but yeah if if i if you need to start collecting this now it's yeah. very expensive it's yeah it's scene tags i think i don't know what it yep. is, its prices are getting so extremely high Oh, it has the the strict manifold as well. Yeah. Very cool. And I know this is also the uh the open air. Yeah. Very cool. It's uh, the emergency car. You can see the, um, the stickers on the on the window. <laughs> oh yeah, these ones here. Yeah. Fifteen, that, seventeen, and nineteen. That's so, when you cross the border with the the yeah. vignette. Normally, I go every uneven year. I go with that car. Yeah. And in between, I went with the Passat one time and one time with uh, with another car. Yeah. So this year I should go with my Golf, but yeah, it was yeah. no emergency. So true. I'm but you you're going in September though, right? Yeah, but for three days. Okay. I don't like to take an old car because it's a lot of driving, then three days meeting, and then. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, that's true. The reloaded, we mostly go with with a comfortable car. Yeah. You can drive all night. This thing is beautiful. So it's coming back in. Look at the sticker. OG. Where it all started. This has been a been a day, huh? Yeah. It was not a, he had he told us like Stop by, drop with the wheels, we'll hang out a little bit. I'll take you to my dad's house, we'll see the car collections. I'm like, all right, cool. I had no idea it was gonna be like this. I mean, look, there's wheels literally everywhere. This man has probably 10,000 wheels. How many How many wheels do you think you have total? No idea. A oh, lot. A lot, yeah. I'm gonna put the number at like thousands, easily thousands. They're everywhere. Like everywhere you look, it's over here, it's the backyard, it's over by the grill, they're everywhere. Would it be complete? <laughs> Gotta have the uh, the coffee table. <laughs> it's so cool. Oh, can take. <laughs> yeah, would it be complete? I expected nothing less of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one final stop. We're going to a French fry place, which sounds delicious. We were starving. It's been a day so far. It's been a day. I didn't expect any of it. Like I said, we've been in his shop before, and there's so many wheels. But to see his house and his car collection, his dad's car collection. Absolutely insane. They're so nice. Like it's, it's so funny that you picked wheels three and a half hours away, and we met such an awesome dude and a good friend of ours now. So cool. And it's a small world. He knows Paul, and it's wild. The car world's cool. The car world is super cool. Yeah, it's a uh, forty-minute drive from here. I don't know either, but this all looks amazing. These are the uh, oh, the fries. Yeah. Uh, um, in between us. I think I have the, uh, <laughs> the burger too. There is no one in front of us. There is absolutely no one behind us. Just broke to ourselves. We're heading to our last stop of the day, which is a small town near Brussels. We're flying out tomorrow. But again, I want to give a massive thank you to Dimitri. Um, 
they always treat us so nice. There's his shop, his new shop, his dad's house, the literally unbelievable car collection. Like I, I've never seen so many wheels and so many rare cars and clean cars and just absolutely amazing. Two Sister Sayer restaurant, which is good. The fry spot was amazing. Uh, just any, any thoughts on this? And this is only the start of our we haven't even gone on vacation yet. We're only in Belgium right now. Absolutely amazing. So yeah, he has uh, her wheels. He's gonna do the clear again on those ones. We might pick them up Wednesday when we get back. Um, but if not, make another trip back with the Nurburgring. You meet him for those ones. Uh, big plans for my BBS wheels. Whether I just do the redrill or we go to three piece. So I'm thinking three piece because I want them a little bit bigger uh, than 70 by seven and a half. But either way, again, big thank you to Dimitri for always hooking us up, showing us everything, and just treating us like family. Such nice people. And again lifelong friends we met because she wanted to buy wheels in a separate country but so much fun uh yeah and if you haven't checked them out already right on the screen uh follow him show him some love amazing guy he has so many wheels like just wheels everywhere they were absolutely everywhere so if you want to buy some wheels um buy them from him he ships them literally all over the world international uh great prices awesome refinish super cool guy and made it Got us that nice corner parking. I gotta say, the KWs ride amazing. Yeah. Like this car rode so smooth the entire way here. Definitely a good upgrade. But I have to show this. When is the last time you ever saw a hotel with a bunk bed? With built-in ladder to the wall. Like, she's sturdy. Stay down there. <laughs> I'm, I'm taking the top bunk. I fight you for it. Also, in this particular one, we have obviously you can see the sink. We have our little desk area, but the showers and the bathroom is down the hall. Kind of different, but yeah, is what it is. But we got a bunk bed. One of them has our sign. I don't see it though. See it? I see it? Yeah! Yeah, it's our guy. We got a whole guy. And he's got an earpiece. Official, official. This is it. Alright, let's go. Yo, we're in Greece. We made it, even though almost missed our flight. Bit of a bit of a run to our plane, but we made it. All the time. I don't know what it is. We leave so early and always a I don't know, but we made it. That's because it's crazy. Got a first mark three. Buy him. I think this is our uh, this is our Airbnb. Look at the view we got at the whole entire island. Look at this. 
Everything's just white, and the view is so sick. You walk outside, just bam, all the island. This is cool. We have it here. Little house tour, shower, bathroom. All right, that's her done. Look at your little helmet. It's so cute. So I haven't showed him yet, but instead of getting a car or walking, we got four wheelers. We out here mobbing through the streets of Greece and the views. Look, they're everywhere. Everyone's got a four wheeler or a scooter, so we're joining the locals. She's a beast. You don't want none of this. <laughs> Got the four wheels all parked up. We got the squad. We got the view. We're eating over there. things are so much fun just cruise across half the island we actually just passed a junkyard that has a mark three golf in it so might stop there yeah foilers were definitely the move these things are so much fun there we go now now we got a full tank before it was literally flashing the gas sign so now we're good look at this my kind of place i think it's a junkyard i didn't see one here though hopefully i can film but i just want to see bam Look, it says Greg on it. Greg, this is for you. That's cool. I mean, it's in, it's in a bit rough shape. I think it's Storm That's Gray, cool actually. Seats, I think it's Storm Gray. What's in it? Some cool seats. I can't, I can't see through all the dust. Oh, those are the factory seats. They're not bad. I like those. Kind of cool, though. I've seen two Mark III so far. A white one, and then uh, this one's the, the Greg edition. Not really, but... Oh, Greg Audio. And Greg actually does audio, funny enough. Greg, this, this car's all for you. What's over here? Oh. Nice. This is the front of it. Look at this little thing. It's probably a 1416. One of those sell to me. No, Susan, we're not. No. <laughs> I kind of want the plate, though. What are those some of the plate? I would love to have a cool, like, authentic no grease there. plate. This is cool. Do you really sing like I think so. Oh, there you go, boys. We found a. I think it's Storm Gray. It looks like Storm Gray. Mark III Golf and a junkyard in Greece. I'm happy. So, the Celica, I think it's the Celica GT, it's got RSs on it. And they're like unsplit factory spec, probably. I wonder if they would sell those. We'll have to bring him on the plane. That's pretty cool. This would be a super cool score. I can't fit everything on the plane, but maybe a set of wheels. Full set, I think. Dang, I think they're BBSs. They might not be. They may be ARE possibly, but either way, they're a uh, three-piece RS style, which is cool. That's awesome. So the little van back here, that thing's dope. There's a really nice uh, Valencia over here. I like this as well. And then I really want these wheels. I think they're closed today, but maybe sometime this week we'll stop by and see if possibly they want to let go of these. That would be sick. And maybe the whole entire Golf 3. Don't know where I'm going to put it, but cool to have it. So we are currently, uh, we out here. Like, we are super out here. What's this remind you of? <laughs> you talking about in Switzerland? Switzerland? Yeah, going fast and then going over. But if I go over that, clip over there, I'm done. Like, this is actually like. My e brake is barely holding it. Yeah, mine too. I'm holding my brake right now because my e brake doesn't work. Watch. <laughs> Instant slide. How you doing? Yeah. We out here. So we're going down that way towards the beach. Um, but we're on this crazy road. It's, it's steep. Like, it's, it's cool though. House up there, a bunch of caves in the hills. It was pretty cool. Uh, it's like Switzerland all over again. But if I go over this curb here or this side, 
Oh yeah, I'm done. It's game over at this point. This is cool though. Yep, yeah, we're going all the way down that, somewhere over that way. We made it. Red Beach. And we drove down the most ridiculous road to get here. I'm not sure if we're supposed to be this far out. We went past like all these. I'm not sure they're abandoned or like, they look, they look unfinished, honestly. There's a whole bunch like this, but we are on the very tip of this side of the moon. The whole island's like a big moon shape. That's the other side, way over there. We're at the edge of this one. Again, four wheelers, best thing ever. You can just cruise on the entire island and just rip these things, it's so much fun. Look at this view. Like I said, all these are unfinished. What is it? Oh, I know you can see the bottom. I'm just gonna, hey, it's in camera. This place is sick. That's a buoy, right? That's not a person. Uh, I hope so. Yeah, it's probably a buoy. I, I hope it's a buoy. Dang, we are like at the edge. That's so cool. So, yeah, this is the outermost tip of this side. And then over there is the, that one right there is the other side of the, uh, the moon. Look how cool this is. Yeah, the water is crystal clear. Even on camera, I can see the bottom. Oh my goodness. It's popping tonight. Good choice. We've been on this boat tour all day and it has been absolutely incredible. Look at this sunset. We toured pretty much the entire island. We did a bit of scuba diving, some snorkeling. This has been amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not sure what I filmed last, uh, but it's currently Monday. We're right by the water and it's crystal clear. Also, this might be the best beach. Probably not the best beach in Greece, but it's nice because you got shade right there. You have rocks instead of sand and the water also we've got a nice cliff diving spot right there which is fun amateur i'm just kidding that's how i cope with being the barnacle boy when he's a really cool mermaid man all right so we're making one more trip up the little mountain pathway here to the uh jumping spot the sand is hot my feet are on fire but i've always wanted to like cliff dive cliff jump and it's so fun look at this spot dude tell me how sick this is this is the coolest beach water cliff jumping and shade it's perfect and the two guys up here on the rock with me i don't know if casey said or not but they're both from frankfurt like an hour from where i live it's funny but this spot is sick yeah this stuff is fire my feet are on fire 
This button is so cool. Do the edge real quick. Bam. So not too high, maybe about 20 feet. I did diving in high school, so this really isn't that high, but it's fun. A lot of fun. Good. Perfect. So it is now Tuesday, our last full day here. And I think I might have found the coolest car I've seen yet. Look at this, Alfa Romeo 33. I don't know what engine, but factory heck blend. Got the wheels on it. Dude, this thing is sick. Look at the wood steering wheel. Wood steering wheel, factory BBS style wheels. I'm not sure that there's ones, but. Yo, this car is sick. Definitely the coolest car I've seen so far. Look at the chrome in the front. Yo, these are sick. I kind of want one. It's very like 80s, 90s, very boxy. Look how cool the, the gas store is. Yeah, this thing's sick. Definitely the cool car I've seen so far. Said last day here, and as you can tell, we're currently in a car, full blown race car. I'm sorry. Full blown race car. This is a Hyundai i10, all the horsepower, and it's fast. Is it fast? She has a test. But we want to go to the far side of the island today. We're on like the the far east coast, basically. We're gonna go to the other side of the island, and on a four wheeler, that'd be a uh, a very very long ride, well over an hour. And it's kind of hard to go on the big streets with the four wheelers because we're kind of small. But now we got a car, gonna explore the far side of the island and then we'll go from there. Also, the little junk cart here, we stopped by yesterday and unfortunately he didn't want to sell me the, the wheels, whatever the BBSs are on that uh, little Salka. So I tried. Look at this view. There's all your white buildings of Greece. We were way up there and now we're uh, almost down to there. It's quite hot. And they've got horses. Yeah, this is steep. <laughs> Not gonna lie though, I did not expect uh, quite this intense of a, uh, a hike down. We were way up there and we still have to go way down to <laughs> that side. It's pretty though. But yeah, it's quite a long walk and these right here, these marble pieces are slick. Like, you go eat it real fast, being careful. She's wild! She's wild! <laughs> wow. These things were the most well spent money ever. Also, her back tires, oh my god, her back tires are completely bald and it just spins like crazy. Your back tires have no grip. I know, that's like a right, look, mine, like mine have some grip, but hers have just uh... no, there's nothing there you got slicks back here <laughs> yeah best money ever spent these are so much fun so we're heading back down to red beach for time to go snorkeling and this is like our last full day here uh we'll probably watch the sunset a little bit and then pretty much it but well, these things are so much fun don't you hit me back up actually she hit me earlier yeah i'm telling i'm, I'm showing the video you're paying for that I got you're paying for that
right, my friends, we are officially back home. Finally, it's been a very long day. And also this has been a very long video, but I wanted to leave kind of everything in because we had such a fun time going to Belgium, going to Greece. It was so much fun. And always visiting Dimitri's shop, uh, Retro Wheels is so much fun. There's so many beautiful wheels in there. And then go see his car collection and his family's car collection. It was just awesome. I had to leave all that because like there's too much not to share so many just beautiful cars beautiful wheels that portion of the trip was amazing and then of course going to Santorini for the first time going to Greece uh, my first time there we had an absolute blast the four wheelers were fun uh, all the sites were beautiful it was hot but we had an absolute blast so I hope you guys enjoyed this video hope you enjoyed all of Dimitri's stuff make sure you guys follow retro wheels hope you guys enjoyed all the sites over in Greece and that is it for this video hope you guys enjoyed do not forget to be thankful for every single day we'll see you guys next time Peace.